Yeah. Yeah. Hey, yo, what's good, you guys? It's Boomer, and you're watching Bali Star today. We get into KSI, JJ Alla, 2G. Jake Paul is insecure. And there's a put a stain on her back. Hey, man, if you know, you know uh, what I just said right there. Um, but yeah, let's get straight on into it, man. JJ talking about Jake Paul being insecure. Make sure you leave a like to support the video. If you enjoy it, subscribe if you're new. So we join up with the all-star gang up in this thing. Let's get straight on into it, man. Let's go. Staring contest. Oh, no. Still do it. You like the way I won. Or does it work that way still? Did it ever work that way? Two. Dylan's actually fighting now? Just in case Dylan Dennis doesn't actually show up. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck they say. Don't count on me. Fury was training hard. I can't wait to show the world why I truly am the Tony 14. That was a diss to uh, Dylan Dennis as well. What he just did there. <laughs> Dylan probably watching this like, oh, this fucker. No, I'm going to show up this time. What YouTubers be like after the video's done? <laughs> Me included, I'm like. Yeah. I don't know, it's weird. Yeah. Exactly. 
that Simon's uh, girlfriend? Or neighbor? Hey, W neighbor, though, you know. If you know neighbors, you know what they'll actually do. Like talking to them Karen ass neighbors. Person I'm below him. Terror <laughs> Barbie. For the plug, bro. Yeah, I mean, it was random, though. Dude, they're like mosquitoes now. But they're like the good kind of mosquitoes. There are no good kinds of mosquitoes. They would be the first kind, the first of their kind. Paul beat him? <laughs> I don't know. Anymore. I didn't watch the fight. <laughs> I can't believe Jake Paul would turn down the KSI fight. I heard Saweetie was one of the cheer girls, though. And that's my, you know what I'm saying? He yeah, won the good mosquitoes. I'm talking to OnlyFans chicks now. Tommy, you and him can rematch to fight me. I'm the final boss. <laughs> That's how this all plays out. Bitch, he said, nah, bitch. You need to beat Gib in a professional bout before you even think about professional. You, what, what, what professional boxing have you even You just box like freaking old dudes, like older dudes. You feel me? I don't think he ever boxed. A person in their twenties, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't even know. Like, boss Javante Davis or some, or twenties or in our thirties. You and Timmy is an exhibition, so the outcome is irrelevant. Valuable promotion, also known as Jake Paul's second account tweet. This. How many rounds did 
Thank you. Boxer. Not even pro boxer. Number two, you want to fight Nate Diaz in an MMA fight, but you want to be a world champion in boxing? Make it make sense. Number three, you couldn't even KO a 40-year-old jiu-jitsu black belt that was way more interested in talking to the audience than fighting. Number four, you're terrified that I'm going to destroy your legacy by beating Tommy Fury. And it is so evident that he is scared that there is a chance. That's why he replied with, You are an exhibition fighter doing exhibition events. Need my brother to make you relevant. I love boxing. You love your ego. I'm helping this war. You are degrading this war. Don't ever confuse the two. And for the record, I will fuck you up in boxing or MMA. Easy. Jay. So then I replied with, when I beat Tommy, you and him can rematch to fight me. I'm the final boss. That's how this all plays out. Because it's bad. Once I beat Tommy Fury, I hold all the cards. I am that guy. And I know Tommy I am him. and Tommy Fury are going to be on my arse wanting to fight. And I'm the one, you know, high up on my throne going, nah, you want to fuck this fight. And I'll decide what I'm going to do after <laughs> Bring out the fighters. You need to be Gib in a professional bout before you even think of professional boxing. What is Gib want to do? That was the most random sentence I don't know. I thought that was kind of weird when he said that too when I read it. I just didn't say, but I thought I was like, Gib. It's like, me being Gib is what is expected. You and Timmy is an exhibition. process he had a chance to do it bro it's like all these words hold no strength these words hold no power so it's like I'm just reading an empty letter here you know it's like bro you're just talking you're not walking bro but I do want to know what the rest of it says I'll do it in London so you you can have all your fans there and be the A side. No one will remember who the A side was. Tweet it. And in case we can do an exhibition, we don't need to go through the whole license process anywhere, anytime, any place. I'll do it in London so you can have all your fans there and you can be the A side, blah, 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 whatever. Uh, he didn't reply. He didn't reply. He didn't reply. <laughs> I shot on him. Wait. It's just a completely different government. 
Canada, Tampa, Buck, Joe Fournier, etc. Same with Jake Paul. He's got all his fights. Deji, Gibb, Nate Robinson, Ben Askren, Tyron Woodley, twice. Addison Silver, Tommy Fury, which he lost. <laughs> he lost, by the way. So, like, look, we all saw that red amongst the green. People start stammering when they know they're wrong. I caught this with uh, an XQC, went at it with uh, H3H3. I don't know sound on his podcast, like he started stammering because of some certain something that was happening, you know, that be going on with his reactions and his stream and stuff. H3H3 called him out on it and he started, you know what I'm saying, not making sense and stammering, try, trying to justify you know what he does what he does on it uh, on his reactions and it's like bro you just hear the fact that like it just doesn't sound right he's just trying to make it sound convincing you know what i'm saying like jake paul giving off the same thing bro and by the way that's that's super fucking wacky it's not just i think it's i think it's lame that they killed him to whatever request that was no because yeah we're, it's our event we're, we're in control of what goes on there and it's funny because going to the XQC H3H3 thing, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I don't usually agree with uh, 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 with H3H3. You feel me? If anything, I mostly think he is in the wrong. And, like he is just off his rocker. You know what I'm saying? So that was a rare, very slight rare V. We're not gonna give it a W. We're gonna give it a V. Why would I do that? That's stupid because they fuck. did it to you. And yeah, it because worse. Because I don't know why the fuck they would do that either. Because they're not good at business. They don't have that out in their fucking contract clause. No, we just team. we just don't care that much. <laughs> why would we have that in the contract saying J. Paul events cannot be promoted on this bit? Why do we care? <laughs> we don't give a shit. It's just funny that you give so much of a shit. <laughs> That's their fucking problem. Stupid fucks. We're, we're smart, diligent. We think of fucking everything that goes so on in all of our smart. events. If you were really smart, you'd know that we are all doing this. This isn't an or space. It's an and space. 
<laughs> Wait, what do you say? Show him what they do, man. Show him how it's done. At least the fire is still there, you know what I'm saying? Keep your fire going, you know? <laughs> Always having to constantly having to prove yourself, you know? Like, it really keeps you fired up, you know what I'm saying? Like, you just don't get bored with being on top all the time, you know? You need, you need people to un underestimate you, you know what I'm saying? Also keeps the fun in it, too. <laughs> yes, 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 no, 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 no. <laughs> Good way to stream. That's pretty good stream right there. Pretty good uh, content topic. <laughs> Bring it on, Granny!
Bring it on. <laughs> Wait, what? Okay, let's go. Yeah, you know, it's like I'm not gonna back out. You know, you know, just because she's 80 years old, don't fuck. She called me out. Oh man, that's how you know she's wild, bro. She probably beat you, bro. That's how you know she's Steve O crazy. Bring it on, Granny. All right, you guys. So that was KSI, Jake Paul's Insecure. Um, man, he just talking outside of his neck right now, man. I ain't hear none he's saying, bro. You know what I'm saying? Don't, I like, with him, bro, I don't want to see none he say, bro. I just want to see him step in the ring with KSI. That's all I want to see. All, all this, bro, like, oh, I'm, like, paying attention. I didn't pay attention to most of what he said because I'm just like, bro, I don't listen to nobody that don't stand 10 toes on their word. You feel me? So, uh, yeah, man, y'all let me know your thoughts about that in the comment section down below. You already know it's a Boomer and you're watching Bolly Star. Make sure to leave a like to support the video if you enjoy it. Subscribe if you're new. So, we're joining up with the All Star Gang up in this thing. Hey, 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 check this out, bro. Stop. Talk about that. I just branded I just dropped a brand new music video, man. Like just now. Just now, look. Oh I don't know what to do. I just want you to come to me.